Hey everybody, it's the 13th Wolfman, and I went out today and I saw a movie. Yeah, it's, I, I know I'm a little late to the game seeing this movie, but there's been so much stuff that's come out in the last couple weeks that I I finally got around to, to seeing this. Um, Annihilation with Natalie Portman and, uh, oh God, who played her husband? Oscar Isaacs, Gina Rodriguez, Jennifer Jason Leigh, who, are, who I've had a mad crush on since... Fast Times, you know, back when I was in high school. Uh, but this movie, this movie is really on the odd side. It's definitely science fiction, and it's it's science fiction for, for science fiction fans. I mean, some people just aren't going to get it. I know there were things that they said. I love science fiction, but there are things that they said in this movie I didn't get at all, you know? Uh, that's one thing I did not like about the movie. I felt that the science part of the movie could have been dumbed down a little bit for the people in the audience. Um, yeah, so Natalie Portman plays a former soldier of the Army who is now a teacher at a university, and she or she teaches at a university or a hospital because she's a doctor. So she's, she's teaching um, genetics. She, she's all, you know, she explains that the, the single cell divides into a double cell, divides into a quadruple cell, into eight, into six, you know, she explains that to her students. And um, that everything on the planet comes from one single cell. At one point in time in life, there was a single cell that divided. And from that single cell, everything is born, whether it's grass, wood, humans are turtles you know I don't know why I picked turtles I just did but uh so she explains this and then we find out that she's got a husband that's still in the army and he's been missing for about a year the movie progresses and goes along and you find out that there's this thing called the shimmer that's encompassing a uh, a lighthouse and some other parts of a national national park and she's going to go in there and find out you know she along with a bunch of other scientists one's a one's a botanist or something like that and Jennifer Jason Lee is just a she's a she's she's a doctor but I don't remember what what she is particularly um, but she's the head developmental character she's the one in charge her and like I said, Gina Rodriguez. Um, and there's a total of five. Two other females and Natalie Portman. They go into this area. And creepy, weird things happen. It's Visually, it's a beautiful movie. Story-wise, it seems like there was... There was more substance than story for me. Uh, I, I would give it two chainsaws out of four. I asked Mama Wolf what she would give it, and she said she would give it two and three quarter chainsaws out of four. Uh, that's just, you know, that's, that's us. That's We sometimes have a different a difference of opinion, and that's fine, you know. I, um, like I said, I enjoyed the movie. The ending is weird as hell, so... If you're up for, like, weird as hell, go see it. But uh, Kevin, over at the Dorkening, he saw this last weekend, so hopefully we'll be talking about it on the Sunday show. Uh, he, he said the same thing about the ending. It's just that it was really out there and on. It, it's a decent movie. Like I said, I don't... The only way that this thing would make it into my collection is if I could find it for like less than, you know, five dollars or less. And I, I would want to see it again on home media because I might be able to like watch like the making of and maybe get a little bit more gist of what's behind the story, you know, uh, what what the whole thing means. So yeah, so like I said. I give it two chainsaws out of four. Mama Wolf gives it two and three quarter chainsaws out of four. Overall, is that like a 
two and a quarter, two and a half, somewhere in there. I mean, if you average them together. So yeah, uh, if you want, check it out. If if you're not really a big sci-fi fan, I say wait for home media. With that, always like, subscribe, share, and comment. I want to know what you have to say. I am the 13th Wolfman, and I am on the prowl.